Hi, I am Katie Inglehop, the Education Coordinator of Agriculture and Gardening here at Old Salem. And today we're in the seed lab. We are doing germination tests. A germination test is where you check to make sure that a plant can still grow from seed. The three things that you need for germination are air, temperature, and water. So what we've done is put water on paper towels, which kind of simulates the soil, and put the seed inside of that and put it in these bags, made sure that there's still air in the bags, and created a little tiny greenhouse. I check these seeds every three days, and this is the 12th day, so this is the last day I'm checking these seeds to see what their germination rate is. So what I've been doing is writing the type of plant it is, so cucumber, and then the variety underneath. So this is the Craven cucumber, and we last grew it out in 2014. And so what I do is I open the bag and pull the paper towel out. Yay, look at all those lovely seeds that have sprouted. So I have 17 seeds in there that did sprout, and so that's what I'm recording. And this tells me that 85% of these seeds germinate. So that's what I would mark. Next we have okra dwarf green variety from 2019. See, that's exciting already. It's growing through the paper towel. All but two. Most of the seeds that we have here are older varieties that are more rare, and that is the vegetables, the flowers, the herbs, things that you might not necessarily see um, at the grocery store. So that's one reason that doing germination tests is important is because this is our direct link to know if these plants are still gonna grow, gonna germinate. Another reason that's important is because if there is a low germination rate, we know that we need to grow those seeds out in the gardens so that we can collect more seed to make sure that our collection is still pretty full. A good time to do germination tests is in the winter and what we find out will directly determine what we plant in our gardens for the spring. So if we have low germination, we know that we need to collect seeds on that plant again, so we need to plant it in the spring. This is an important part of the maintenance of our seed collection here at Old Salem. 